Hey, Kevin, um, you guys were coming off a great third quarter where you and Kyrie were really hot, and then it just kind of turned on you in the fourth. What did you think was the difference? They kind of flipped the game on you. I thought our second unit did a good job to start the fourth. Um, you know, the, getting up, getting a six-point lead, but they have four of their starters in to start the fourth quarter. So, you know, obviously having more talent on the floor, having their guys on the floor, that could change quickly. Um, but I thought the start of the fourth quarter was pretty solid for us. But they made, they got a nice groove going in that fourth, made shots, made plays, and you got to give them credit. Well, you can Andrews, ESPN. Kevin, Steve said if he were to take something from these last two games, it would just be that you all have to be conscious of the fact that you don't have a shared history that a team like the Bucks has where they've been running the same schemes for three years. What do you think it's going to take to kind of uh, – out uh, make up for that work around that um that is a huge factor i mean um you know continuity is a big thing in this league but we got veterans on this team that played in different situations that kind of they know pretty much every terminology that goes on in this league and uh, every kind of set that we run on both sides so uh that's in our advantage as well having that veteran leadership um but you know, we we still are a connected group. I feel like we've been together for years too, so we got to continue to keep building on that. Alex Schiffer, Alex Schiffer, the other. Hey Kevin, they had that eighteen one run in the fourth quarter. Did you think you guys were forcing anything offensively, shot wise, or was it as simple as the ball not going in during that stretch and you guys were getting good looks? You think we were forcing stuff, Alex? I'm I'm asking you. All right. Uh. I mean, yeah, I mean, you can probably, we mean, we maybe took some risks there, you know what I'm saying? We probably could have maybe made an extra pass or two, but some of those risks you got to you gotta live with, especially when guys are knocking down shots. You know, Kyrie was knocking down shots. I was making a few shots. So, uh, you know, we could watch film and see which possessions that we probably could have been better in, but I like our aggressiveness. I like how we were trying to get into the paint and get to a free throw line. Uh, but the team got hot. Their team got hot, and we didn't we didn't rebound enough. They shot fourteen more shots than us. And a team like that, we can't allow that to happen. Christian Winfield, New York Daily News. Hey Kevin, um, during that same run in the fourth quarter, uh, Steve obviously didn't call the timeout, and I'd asked him about that, and he goes, "Hey, you know, maybe I should have." But also, you know, he's kind of brought it up over time and time again that he likes you guys to play through those runs without calling the timeouts, so that you guys could problem solve and figure things out for yourselves. Mm -hmm. uh, I'm wondering if a you've played for a coach like that that's made you do that instead of calling a timeout when teams go on runs, and b what you've learned this season through playing through those runs. Yeah, I've. Uh... Um, been around coaches that handled that situation differently and Steve has handled it differently as well he might have let us uh, figure it out ourselves or he might call the timeout I think all coaches you know make that decision throughout a game and it can go either way uh, but I think it's good for us to problem solve and figure things out and continue to keep growing as a unit when things get tough out there and uh, we still end up making it in the game after that you know what I'm saying we were down 11 points I think and we he, we were down five, and I had the ball in my hands, and uh, you know, so with a, under a minute to go. So, uh, you know, I think we fought through that little stretch as well. So, it's, it's plenty of times throughout this year I've seen coach do both things: call a timeout or let us play, and let us play.